Northbrook native when she was just 12 years old on our Child Prodigy show. Now at 14, she was recently a finalist on America's Got Talent. Put your hands together for opera singing sensation Laura Breton. <laughs> Open your mouth. I want to see how that voice comes out of there. Uh, how does that happen? Um, God, I guess. Yeah. He, yeah, he just blessed me with a gift. <laughs> yeah. Now, most girls your age are, are singing Taylor Swift and Beyonce. Yeah. What is it about opera music that captures your heart? It's just different, and it's just the most complex form of art. And it, I mean, when you sing opera, you feel something. And I wanted to feel that emotion. And yeah, it's just beautiful and different. And yeah. <laughs> it is beautiful and different. And all of America got to see it on America's Got Talent. You were a yeah. finalist on the show. What was that experience like? Oh my God, it was so incredible. <laughs> it was such an honor to be there. And I was so excited to be able to participate in such a big opportunity. And yeah. It was great. It was so fun. And I know you had to keep it a secret, right? Like some of your friends weren't too happy because you couldn't tell them you were on the show. How'd that happen? No. <laughs> no? Did they forgive they, you now? They did. <laughs> they did. What do you want to do? Do you want to continue to be a professional opera singer? Um, yes, I would like to continue with um, being an opera singer, but I would also like to try other genres. <laughs> other genres? So yes. the Taylor Swift and the Beyonce's? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Laura, you're amazing. Thanks for being here. Keep thank coming so back in to see us at Wendy City Live, okay? Okay. Thank All right. You. We got to take a break. Give it up one more time, Laura Breton.